Penn Air might have to stay grounded in Plattsburgh longer than anticipated. This report, issued by the Department of Transportation, outlines the rules and regulations regarding Plattsburgh's Essential Air Services Agreement, a federal program that subsidizes airlines that are chosen to fly from rural airports to larger hubs. In March, the DOT selected SkyWest to take over Plattsburgh's Essential Air Service. SkyWest will provide 12 weekly nonstop round-trip flights to Washington, D.C. starting August 29th. That's about two months after Penn Air's Essential Air Services contracts, which provides nonstop flights to Boston, expires on June 30th. On July 1st, ticket prices on Penn Air's website skyrocket more than 430 percent. Round trip flights from Plattsburgh to Boston cost more than $800 compared to less than $160 if you fly between now and July. Penn Air told NBC5 News it plans to fulfill only its existing contract and customers who bought tickets at an inflated rate will be refunded. However, the DOT explicitly says in this report, if SkyWest is unable to start service on July 1st, 2018, Penn Air is required to serve Plattsburgh with the current service pattern until SkyWest begins full EAS at the community. We took this to Penn Air, which has not returned our request for comment. We asked the DOT if Penn Air is allowed to charge increased ticket prices after its contract expires and still receive federal money for providing essential air service. The DOT has not returned our request for comment, but airport manager Chris Craig says if that's the case, it's, quote, disappointing.